hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is neima if you're new welcome if you're a returning subscriber welcome back so today i'll be talking about five things i am dropping in 2022 in order for me to become a millionaire in 2023 in order for me to become rich in 2023 if you go through what you purchase in a year trust me there are a lot of things you should not be buying or there are some things you should cut down on in order to become rich Little, little things like this you think do not matter is what actually matters. You have to recheck your 2023, what you purchase the more and try to cut it down and take a look at how your um, money or your savings become better and you get. So let's just dive into this video without wasting much of your time. So the first thing I am dropping in 2022 definitely is junk. Whether to my bank account and to my health, I am dropping junk. I would be feeding more or um house made food, food I make myself, or food made in the house. Whether my friends, myself, or my mom. Since I'll be resuming school, I know I have no choice than to eat my friends' food. I am dropping buying all those burgers shawarma pizza ice cream and all of those things i am dropping them in 2022 because i realized that i eat more of junks compared to the normal homemade food it's not as if the homemade food is not there the homemade the homemade food is there but i don't just find it pleasing to eat again and that is because i have conditioned my mind to believe that junk is what is making me full like no matter how i eat homemade food i do not get filled up like i do not get full up i eat and eat and eat but as soon as i just eat one shawarma i am full for the rest of that day you get and it is making me spend more now imagine a small size of shawarma like the mini shawarma you know or the regular shawarma you know costs nothing less than 1400 naira. yes and plus delivery let's say 500 that is 1900 even if you're going to pick up yourself you'll be paying nothing less than 300 for delivery that's one eight approximately is it one eight yes that's one seven one eight approximately now let's imagine you eat that in a week like three times how much would you be spending calculate it and calculate how much you spend going to the market getting a cup or two cups of rice oil beans uh, meat if possible calculate it and see how much you'll be saving if you stop buying junk the next thing that makes me not um eat more of home food is laziness i find it very I, I am a lazy person mostly when my schedule is tight i tend to be more lazy when my schedule is tight now that i'll be resuming school i'll not have time for myself i'll always be busy i find it difficult to cook for myself i always just opt out for I will just up for junks because it's easily to to to, to get um, over having to cook yourself and all of those things. And you know when you cook yourself, you have to wash plates, you have to do all those things. So it becomes very very hectic for me. So I just opt for um, eating outside. I have decided that in 2023 I am dropping that bad habit because one, it is not healthy to my bank account. It is also not healthy to my health account. You get your health is like an account. What you take in matters, and what you give in also matters. So I am dropping that in 2022. The next one is data because of YouTube, because of uploading videos on YouTube, I spend too much on data. It has become frustrating. Like I cannot even account for the amount the money i spent for on, on on data just because i upload on youtube it takes me at least three gig to upload an eight minute video you can imagine how that is consuming my money it, it's, not, it's not as if i am making money from youtube already i am still giving out to youtube or i'm still giving in i'm still giving youtube my money while youtube is not giving me anything back you get so it has really really dipped or gotten into my account and i am stopping that in 2023 i do not know how i'll be doing it but i would definitely be reducing the way i purchase data in 2023 coupled with the fact that i sleep and wake up on 
the social media or on social media i am on facebook i am on instagram i am on whatsapp i am on twitter though no, not on twitter but i am on instagram whatsapp and facebook and also youtube commenting like watching videos liking and all it is consuming a lot of data for me making me spend too much on data I am dropping that in 2023 we will find a way around that definitely please if you want to sponsor my data please please just send me a dm on instagram i am no longer shy i'm not ashamed again i want to come out and beg if you want to sponsor my data please come to my dm and let's talk about it because the way i spend data on this youtube and i just have to be consistent whether i like it or not i have to be consistent so that the algorithm will not forget me the algorithm will not forget me on youtube so i have to post consistently the next one is soda soda has become my water to be honest i can drink three bottles of soda in a day trust me i am not exaggerating i can drink three bottles of soda in a day that is not healthy it is not healthy to my health it is not healthy to my bank account i am dropping that in 2023 you know when you just you go out you come back and you're thirsty and tired the, the first thing in my mind is definitely not water but soda that is unhealthy coupled with the fact that i am an ulcer patient taking soda that has gas has done a lot of harm to my health than good and i keep on doing it maybe because i am addictive but you see this 2023 that addiction you will find where you belong to and leave my body because my account is showing red and i don't want that in 2023 like i said in one of my videos i want to be financially cautious in this 2023 i want to every details that leaves my account i want to be aware of it i don't just want to have that nonchalant attitude to my money i don't want to have that i don't care attitude to what is coming into my account and what is leaving i want to know how much is living how much i spend on this monthly how much i spend on that weekly and how i am able to manage everything i want to be cautious of it this 2023 i no longer get full with water water does not quench my thirst anymore it has to be soda it has to be something sugary it has to be something gaseous and that is not healthy for me at all my fat my tummy if you see my tummy now it is flapping it is shaking my hands i have a mother arm, arm now and i think soda and junks plays a huge role in all of this and i want to stop that in 2023 the next one is clothes i want to reduce the way i buy clothes you know, i am not a material person i am not a fashion type i am not a fashionista or something i don't really spend much in clothes but when it comes to ashway b i try as much as i can to assist my friends whenever they are getting married i try as much no matter i try my best to make sure i buy your ashway b and uh, just to support you do you get just to support you just to assist you because i know you need that money at that time so i try my best to assist you by buying your ashobi like but trust me i am dropping that in 2023 because those same friends are not there for me when i need them the people i least expect the people I, I i do not even help that don't even get anything from me are the ones that are always there for me and those friends that i'm breaking my accounts for because i want to help them are not there when i need them so i am stopping that or i am dropping that shit in 2023 i cannot be wasting my money on ashway b because after the wedding trust me because one i would have to buy um the material from you and i may not like that material because when it comes to clothing i am usually choosy i am not someone that goes with anything everything does not work with me so i just have to buy because i'm trying to assist you i'm trying to help you or support you so i buy the material which i am not okay with or which on normal day i would not even buy two i have to sew it the way you want like the kind of um what do you call it the kind of design you want it because that is what your what that is what you want for your friends and i also may not be comfortable with that one i would only sew when i know okay it will cover all of my body but i am not comfortable with certain designs about that sewing i just have to do it because i want to support you and at the end of the day spend thousands of money for your ashwabi and at the end of the day i will not wear that clothes again because i will not have a wedding to attend i am not a wedding type i will not have a wedding to attend one and two i am not an outgoing person so i hardly go out three i cannot just wear that ashwabi for a different wedding because that other bride would have her own ashwabi so i may end up not even wearing that your own ashwabi at all do you get i will just dash it out to, or give it out to somebody after spending thousands of money you wear it one day and give it out to somebody but i'm dropping out in 2023 
if I have so if you're getting married and you there's a should be instead of me to buy your I should be I'll rather give you let's say half of that money and stay in my father's house or just go with the clothes i have in my box the last one is charity this would be a tough one for me but i just have to do it i am someone that would displace myself for people like i find it difficult to say no when you ask for my help but i have realized that people are very comfortable to turn you down people are absolutely fine turning you down they don't even feel guilty they don't even feel bad that i cannot help my ima they turn you down and move on when they need your help they come back and me will feel uncomfortable comfortable to turn you down i am dropping that in 2022 i will not inconvenience myself just because i want you to be convenient or just because i don't want you to feel bad i will only help the less privileged there are a lot of people that need your help a lot of people that need food on the street a lot of people that are hungry on the street that need our help and not you my friend that can afford all your all your basic needs but because of your oju kokoro you will now want to use me to add more to yourself do you get i am not helping you in that way again i'm sorry but that is the truth i would rather help those people on the road that have not eaten that do not even have clothes to wear that do not even know where the next meal is coming from i would rather give those people that money than give it to you as my friend that is comfortable but not just oju kokoro the warrior I am dropping this in 2023 too yeah so yeah i want to be more intentional about my money in 2023 and i hope you're also working towards that as a young girl like myself if you enjoyed this video like share subscribe do not also forget to subscribe to my other youtube channel the Iman's journey it is always on the it is always in the description box i will be on the screen see you in my next video bye